What you got? Give us up. What you got? Frankie Kazarian, Christopher Daniels, ready to talk. Hands raised once again. Now that you won tonight, are you ready to go for those tag team titles? We're always ready to go for tag team titles. It doesn't matter what company we're in, whether it's Ring of Honor or New Japan. Christopher Daniels, Frankie Kazarian, 45 years combined experience. World Tag Team Champions of the World on four separate occasions. Looking for number five. Is it New Japan's gold? Could, Could be. be. Could be, we've beaten the Young Bucks before. If they get through tonight against G.O.D., we could challenge the Young Bucks. We've done it before. We've done that dance. We've done it before. Do you think the Young Bucks or the firing squad have anything on you guys? I think you guys have a pretty good claim to being one of the best tag teams of all time. Hey, you know, both those teams can also boast about it. Certainly the Young Bucks are looked upon all over the world as perhaps the best tag team of all time. But you're not going to have that conversation if you don't talk about Christopher Daniels and Frankie Kazarian, especially after a night like tonight. You know, here in the States, it's homecoming dance season. All the girls are getting dolled up. All the guys put on their finest suits to go to the homecoming dance. Well, tonight was Christopher Daniels and Frankie Kazarian's SCU. This is our homecoming. homecoming. And this is my dance partner. Hell yeah. And going forward, we're going to do that dance all over the world. Listen, like he said, you know that the Bullet Club, no matter who it is, are tough. Young Bucks, tough. G.O.D., tough. But tonight, we took care of two of Bullet Club's best. Hangman Page, Chase Owens, two of the best. They've been part of Bullet Club for a long, long time. First time out of the gates against us, they go down. We get our hands raised. We can do another Bullet Club dance anytime. Anytime. Let's go right now. <coughs> Let's go right now. Let's oh, wait. go. They're probably doing another match. Can we expect to see you in the World Tag League? That would be great. Christopher Daniels and Frankie Kazarian, we were in the Tag League two years ago. We would love another opportunity to get in the Tag League. We had a very respectable tag league debut we defeated such teams as okada and yoshihashi we defeated tama tonga and bad luck fale i remember we had great success but for some reason we haven't returned maybe this is the opportunity maybe this win tonight is the doorway to have this is our window because in two years since that last tag league appearance we've only gotten better as individuals and as a team. And way more handsome. You've gotten way more <laughs> handsome. Way more yeah. handsome. Yeah. And we now have a whole state, well, half a state, the better half of the state behind us, our brethren and sisters out here in SoCal supporting us. SoCal, run a wild all over the world, brother. How are those Hot Topic t-shirt sales? Awesome. Off the charts. Sold out. <laughs> Off the charts. Sold out in a lot of stores. We're the only, we're the only top seller that isn't Bullet Club affiliated. SoCal Uncensored. Top cool. notch. Top it's notch. Cool. You had a question, young lady. Yeah, you guys are now zero and four against the Briscoes. And you know, they're the ROH tag champs. So what Oof. are you gonna do besides this win to bounce back from that? That's a pretty big loss. Let me it's explain something loss, about the Briscoes. Correct. You see this up here? Pretty ugly looking. You know why? Because I had to have my head super glued back together two nights ago in Las Vegas. You know why? Because Mark Briscoe, the madman that he is, threw a chair at my head. They're reckless, they're dangerous. And they're warriors. And yeah, we are 0 4. You know what? Maybe we'll be 0 5. Maybe we'll be 0 10. It's that one win that counts. When we beat them, we take their titles and we secure our jobs in Ring of Honor. Jay Just Briscoe, one. Jay Briscoe gave me a Jay Driller on the floor. Jay, Dr Jay Driller in the ring. It took two of them to beat me. And let me tell you, my neck is still sore. My neck is very, very fragile. After 25 years, all the injuries I've had, Jay Driller twice, it was very dangerous. But that doesn't mean that I'm shying away from a rematch with Jay and Mark Briscoe. We've made the open challenge. All we have to do is earn that opportunity again to get in the dance against the Briscoes. And hey, I don't mind taking the Ring of Honor Tag Team titles to the Tag League. So maybe it happens that quickly. Or maybe when we win the Tag League, we come back and win the Tag Team titles from the Briscoes. Are you happy? Which way we, how do you want to do Six and one, half a dozen the other, as they say. Both of you are still Cal regulars. What does it mean to be on the show tonight? It's awesome. It's, uh, it's obviously a very special event. New Japan bringing their unique brand of professional wrestling that's just gaining popularity by the second. To bring it here to Los Angeles, not only in the farm of the LA Dojo, but to put on a show in our backyard, Southern California. You know, we both made our names in this part of the state. But nowadays, we're all over the world. We don't get an opportunity to come back here often. So when we do, we go out there, we hear reactions like that. People that have been following us for 25 and 20 years. It means a great deal. Uh, next time we come back, I want to bring Scorpio Sky so you get the whole SCU trio. And I want this to become a regular thing. New Japan in SoCal. 
SCU in SoCal. If you listen to the people right now, you listen to them right now, they're on fire. They appreciate great wrestling. That's why Christopher Daniels and Frankie Kazarian have been here this whole time. We've been building our names here. These people know what great wrestling's all about. So for someone like Okada, someone like Tanahashi, someone like Jay White, someone like the rest of the Bullet Club, all of these guys are here because they know that the best crowds are in Southern California. And that's why these shows have been so successful. And I hope they continue. And I hope they keep putting us on it because we'll keep winning. How's that? You know it. I'll Guys, like what was the X factor tonight? Was it the home hometown advantage? Was it the experience factor? I mean, and quite frankly, I think you guys look just as athletic, if not more so, than I've been watching you guys for over a decade. You look just as crisp and athletic as I've ever seen you. Well, you know what? One thing, there may be bigger teams, there may be faster teams, but there's not a smarter team. There's not two guys on this roster that are going to work harder than Christopher Daniels or myself. Inside the ring or out. You know, this, isn't, this is our life, this is our career, this is, this is our shot. You know, what you see in the ring is just 10, 15, 20 minutes of 23 and a half hours of a day that is nothing but pro wrestling. It's boarding a flight at midnight, it's getting into town at 6, it's getting to the gym at 7, it's getting to the building at noon, it's preparing all day, it's wrestling, and then it's going and doing the same thing. Town after town, night after night, you will not find two guys in this business as a tag team that work harder than Christopher Daniels or myself. I challenge you, any team, any organization, I don't care what your initials are, I don't care if you have one name, I don't care where you're located, find a better, more solid, harder working tag team than Christopher Daniels. They don't exist. There's only two things I've done in my life longer than I've been a professional wrestler and that's speak English and drive a car. And I've fought for more than half of my life to be one of the best wrestlers in the world. And part of that means fighting to get into the best companies in the world. That's why I've tried to have a relationship with New Japan over the last decade. I've had a little bit of success. A lot of people don't like to talk about it. That's fine with me though. But this tag league that we were in two years ago, that was our first taste of success in New Japan. Tonight, another taste of success. The next time we go to New Japan, more and more success. So you Thank you. This is it. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, really yeah we've been here a while. We're talking about you guys. You can ask me out here. You guys finish for a